Detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do, man. We just running a little bit behind, about 30 minutes behind. We supposed to be here by 9.30. We we'll about to make a few stops, get a few things from Walmart and Dollar Tree. But right now, we about to do this Honda Civic right now. We in Cool Springs at Of Me. Uh, we about to do about four or five cars here for a girl named Skylar. Uh, she got my information for the other ladies that Of Me out there located in uh, Green Hills. Uh, but uh, yeah, so we about to go ahead and work on the interior first. It's a little dirty. You know I mean, got your typical debris, got the sticks, your twig, a little bit of dog hair. You know I mean, she keep her dog with her. And then also she got a stick on the back of her car that says dog mom. So to let you know, she always have her dog. But there's nothing that we can't handle over here in your way mobile podcast service. Like I tell you, also got to make sure you get into these doors. Little cracky crevices right here. Sometimes behind the door, you know, wiping on the steering wheel, things like that. No, don't spray it yet. Yeah. But uh, yeah, like I said, always get on the side of these seats because you know that's where a lot of the debris be. And then you look, most of the passenger seat and if they got kids, I mean the driver's seat and if they got kids, the back you the dirtiest. But we're going to go ahead and get a cup holders, panels, monitors, things like that. See, you got some crushed up candy right there. These seats are a little dirty, so we're going to make sure we wipe down the seats and everything. Uh, we got to do this car, Range Rover, a white car right here, and there's another car up front. But, like always, man, stay dedicated to the process, man. And on that note, man, make sure you hit that subscribe button, man. Leave a like, comment on this video, and make sure you share it, man. I know a lot of y'all don't share it, because y'all like, well, I'm going to share this video. Like I say, share with your catchy dog. I know you bunch of cat iPads listen to cat videos, man. You know what I mean? But, like always, do what you're going to do, man. And I'm going to catch you in a minute, baby. Detail world, detail world, what it do, man. We just finished this Honda Civic right here, man. <laughs> we just finished this Honda Civic. We just did do a basic interior, exterior on it, but you know how dirty it looks. Sometimes you're like, man, that's just a basic, but basically we finished it in less than an hour, like 45 minutes. So it don't really be that bad. It just, it just looks tedious. And then, like I said, had it been another type of car, like a Toyota, it probably would have took a, bit, a little bit longer. Cause like I tell y'all, Toyota's got some shitty carpet. And it's very hard to get a lot of the debris out the carpet. Honda's, Mercedes Benz, BMW, they make pretty good carpets. The reason I didn't say Lexus, because Lexus is made by Toyota. You know, uh, and these Teslas, they got good carpets. Some of the Teslas, I just noticed that, like in Tesla Model 3, they got shitty te carpet in it. But when you get the, the trucks and the the Model S, they got a different type of carpet. So it's weird that they put two different type of carpets in these cars. But I just showed you the interior of the car. Car look came out fine, came out great. We wiped down everything in the inside. Uh, like I say, young girl, she was able to get us some more work today, so I appreciate Skylar. May get her ten dollars this. Nope, that ain't happening. <laughs> but we about to go ahead and park and pull over the next car, get it cracking, and we gonna catch you in a minute. Hey, detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do, man. We on this second field for right now. We still at the same location. Like I said, we gonna be right here all day. We not really moving around. That's the best thing I said about that. Being in one spot, doing several cars. You can get a lot done with a less time because you know you're moving around from each place to each place. It's literally about a 15 to 20, 30 minute drive time. But we doing this Range Rover right here. I think this is a Range Rover Evoke. I'm not 100%. Yep, it's a Range Rover Evoke. The reason I say that, I knew it was that because this is a little bit smaller. The Range Rover like that big and this one like that big. But anyway, if you look at the front wheel, we already knocked out the front wheel over here. We got all the dirt, grime, and all the brake dust off of here. If you look at this one, this is what the wheel looks like. Very highly concentrated in brake dust and grime and things like that. Look at the bottom of the car. Got a lot of dirt, grime, and everything like that. Also, we're going to make sure we get all that off. Let me get a quick glimpse of the interior of this car. Let me turn it down real quick. We don't want any copy drag you. But if you look at the interior car, it's your typical debris like always. It sticks, twigs, rocks. And like I said, we're going to start adding dog hair onto it because dog Dog hair is always going to be in these people's cars. They love their dog. Well, I'm not sure if this dog hair or her hair, because that hair is pretty long. But uh, anyway, uh, like I said, we all get into the cracks and crevices right here. Cal's going to go ahead. He already working on the interior. He's probably over there knocking it out doing his thing. So I'm going to go ahead and work on this exterior as quick as possible. And then I'm going to go ahead and hop in the interior and help him. Like I said, it's a beautiful day. No, no sun today. No, there she is. It's all cloudy today. Yesterday, it stormed like a mug. So I always say after the storm, it become officially fallen. If you look at the trees, all the trees are already losing their leaves and things like that. But like always, man, I'm gonna stay committed to the process. So you stay committed to the process, whatever you got going on in your life, man. Stay persistent, relentless, and consistent. And no matter what you're doing, man, you always gonna prevail. And like always, always, yeah. 
Detail World, Detail World, what it do, what it do, man? We just finished this second vehicle, which was this Range Rover Evo. You know, Range Rover made by Land Rover, but man, we uh got it knocked out, man. We about to definitely uh head up, start on the next car, which is this Acura. So uh, give you a quick glimpse of the interior. Uh, car came out very good. You remember what the wheels looked like? They was extremely dirty, but I love this great interior in this car. It looks immaculate. You know, even with these like light white color seats too. They're very nice. But like I said, we got it all nice and knocked out of here, man. Cal right now putting the other max in. So we're about to go ahead and pull over the other car. Go ahead and get started on that, man. But like always, man, do what you gotta do. And I'm gonna do what I gotta do, man. Make sure you hit that like, man. Leave a comment. What you think about the color on this car? Is this a real cool, nice color? You know what I mean? You like the color of this car? Or it just look like some of that ice cream, pastel ice cream. But like always, do what you gotta do, and I'm gonna catch you in a minute. Detail world, detail world, what it do, man? We done made it. Well, not made it. We still at the same spot. But we doing this third vehicle, which is this Acura RDX. Not 100% sure what RDX stands for. You know what I mean? But if you look at the car, I love this tan color seats. Tan is one of my favorite color when it comes to interior cars. And with a good black carpet or a dark carpet, I hate light like color carpet. But I love the way they have these speakers on the doors now. You know, they got two set of speakers, so I can imagine the sound system in this thing is probably immaculate. Once again, this is an Acura RDX. I like the whole little console right here. This kind of like Mercedes Benz, I mean BMW, they had the first thing that kind of had like a little mouse pad thing in, plus Lexus. But you see, it got all of the weight. You put the park reverse things like that. She got two car seats in there. I told her we can work around the car seats. We're not going to take them out. But like I say, you got the tip for the three. Tick, stick, tick, sticks, twigs, uh, hair, things like that. But exterior of the car, like every other car, is mal, mal, uh, mal road grind, things like that. But we're going to go ahead and work on this interior first. We actually got this car to do, that Jeep to do, and then we still got to do that for it. We already knocked out those two cars right there. So we're gonna go ahead and knock out this Acura RDX and I'm gonna catch y'all in a minute. Hey. Detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do, man. We just finished this Acura RDX. Like I said, we got it nice and looking good. Uh, she had some car seats in there, but we worked around the car seats. I told her she wanted the uh, seats clean. She could take the car seats out and things like that. But a lot of these people had their car seats put in. Well, I don't know these seem like it's put in. But the inside of the car came out well. I know the match look a little wet. We're gonna come in here and dry them off. But the rest of the car came out fine. Door jams, everything. I'm about to go ahead and park it and then do this next vehicle, which is a Jeep. And then we're gonna work on the sport. You know what I mean? But uh, yeah, man. We got it going today. Today is a beautiful day. It was a little chilly. The high today supposed to be 60. You know what I mean? Low tonight supposed to be 42. So tonight might have to turn that heat on. You know, but if you ain't got to turn the heat on, just put the heat in your room. Keep your room. Try to keep them bills down while you can because it's going to get cold this winter because we already had a few nights uh, like two weeks ago where it dropped down to like 29, 30, 31, like three days in a row. It actually broke some records to it within the south of being cold. Like it actually got like 38 degrees in Miami, things like that. But we just finished the car. About to head to the next spot. Make sure you do what you got to do and I'm going to do what I got to do and I'll catch you in a minute. Hey. Detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do, man. We didn't made it to this fourth vehicle, which is this Jeep Grand Cherokee, man. You know, they got two different Cherokees. They got the Jeep Cherokee, then they got the Grand Cherokee. The Grand Cherokee is the one that got a little bit more amenities than the Cherokee. But I like the inside of this car. It's uh, kind of big. It's bigger than it. they usually big. You know what I mean? But you see the exterior. It definitely needs to be clean. But the interior really not that bad, I wouldn't admit a little dusty in here, not a lot of dirty debris in here, but it is your typical debris. You know what I mean? Your sticks, twigs, and you see the monitors and consoles, definitely gotta get in there. But, you know, the back is probably the dirtiest, about it, but things like that. The car looks great. I like these seats, the third row seating is everything. It got the Al, it got the Alpine system in here. It's definitely a beautiful uh, car, man. I love it. You know what I mean? Kind of look basic, but I can imagine. You know, it kind of got that Jeep rag in there a little bit. But I'm gonna go ahead and knock on this exterior. He's gonna work on the interior of however you need my help. But we're gonna go ahead and do what we do, man. Y'all do what y'all gotta do, man. Make sure you leave a like, leave a comment, and I'm gonna catch you in a minute. Peace. Detail world, detail world. What it do, what it do, what it do. We just finished this Jeep Grand Cherokee, man. We got it all nice and knocked out. The car came out looking good. Like I said, it really don't take too much to get these cars going once you're in the motion. You know what I mean? And then we already just being in the same spot to kind of help out. But if you look at the interior of the car, the interior of the car came out well. If you remember, it had 
dirt and debris literally everywhere. All on the floorboard up there, things like that. Monitor, things like that, real messy. But we got the car looking great. Doors clean, door jams clean, things like that. So uh, like I said, this is the fourth car. We actually finna do the fifth car right now. But the Jeep Chan Carry key came out nice. So, so far we did the, uh, the Acura. We, done, we did an Acura, a Honda, a Range Rover, now the Jeep. Now we're about to do this floor. But like always, man, we take pride in what we do over here at Your Way Mobile Car Care. So make sure you take pride in whatever you're doing in life, man. Be consistent, religious, and persistent. And like always, do what you gotta do. I'm gonna do what I gotta do. Or if you do what you gotta do, and I'm gonna do what I gotta do. And I will catch you in a minute, peace. Detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do, man. We didn't say the baddest for the last, man. This car right here is dirty, but like I say, we just gonna do the best that we can. We not finna go all out. We not finna pull out the bazookas. We not finna hit it with the grenades. We just finna pull out the AKs and the, AC, the uh, M16s and hit it like that. But, you know, car need to be nuked. It just need to be, just blow it off the map. But other than that, man, we about to go ahead and knock it out. This is a Ford Focus, but she need to focus on keeping this car a little bit more clean than what it is. It is stuffed totally everywhere. But man, we're gonna definitely get it cracking, man. There's nothing that we can't handle over here at Your Way Mobile Car Care Service. Like I say, we take pride in everything we do, man. So, uh, so just make sure you do what you gotta do, man. But it's all good. I'm gonna catch y'all in a minute, man. Like I said, it's gonna be it's gonna be a little task at hand, man. But it's all good, man. We're gonna catch y'all in a minute. Good. Detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do, man. We just finished this last car today, man. It took us a little bit time to do it. It was a little bit dirty, but it is what it is, man. Like I said, it comes with the territory when you out here, man. Dealing with different people and people you never dealt with. This is my first time ever doing her car. So, yeah, the chances of me seeing what her car looked like prior to was um, impossible. Only car I'd done before was that black Acura right there. And I told her since I was coming out here, she got more people that may be interested in getting their cars clean, let me know. Said it may be six or seven, we actually did five. She said the other two people would come in. I know I go do one of the girls tomorrow at the other facility. But uh, like always, man, the car came my way. I will not be tired, Shannon ain't tired, you know what I mean? So, but the car, if y'all remember what it looked like in the interior, man, this car was hellacious, man. It was bad. You remember it had stuff all on the doors, the door jams was caked up with brown stuff. These seats had all type of debris. The cup holder was completely covered in gook, things like that. If you just recall what it looked like, man, so this ain't another car. This is exactly the same car, you know what I mean? We just take pride over here what we do. You know, because you got to make sure you do your job correctly to continuously get business. Because like I say, business is all about getting repeats. I don't too much care about getting new customers all the time. I'd rather have my repeats. So, uh, but in the process of you doing work this good, you will make the people that's new customers become, that's the best thing about it, people that love your work and it's like her, she's definitely gonna be highly enthused with the work and if she's not, I don't know what to say. Cause y'all saw what the car look like. And if she's not happy, something gotta be mentally wrong. But uh, we finish here, man. Finna head home, probably about 30 minutes away plus traffic. It'll probably take about a good 40 minutes to get there. It's probably about three something. Traffic starts to build up a little bit around the time. Cause a lot of people get off work a little earlier than usual. A lot of people down here in Tennessee don't work a lot of nine to five. They work a lot of um, six to three, seven to four, things like that. Or seven to three, six to three, something, however the time go. But camera doing some weird stuff. I don't know why it's trying to focus somewhere else. But like always, man, look in that mirror, say one love, always love thyself, man. You gotta love yourself before you love anyone else. If you love somebody else before you love yourself, you failed at life. And like always, man, yeah.